16 on this Wednesday night, and we're continuing to follow this breaking news developing on the west side of Indianapolis. A fire at the Walmart distribution center that's located in Plainfield. You can see clearly how thick and how black the smoke was rising over the Walmart building this afternoon. Kevin Mangus shared this video that he took from the airport area. People are reporting that they've seen this for miles around. Oh, yes. I mean, it was really an impressive uh, plume of smoke. Unfortunately, it's died down a little bit at this hour. This fire started a little bit before noon, so now we're five hours in. Jenny Runovich joins us live from the scene right now with the latest of what she's learned from authorities there. Hey, Jenny. Yeah, Anne Marie, this is hour five of a massive fire at a really massive facility. This Walmart distribution center, 2.1 million square feet. So there is a lot of stuff in there that can burn and burn it did. Now you mentioned it looks a lot different. Uh, you can see there is still a plume of black smoke. The firefighters are still battling this fire, but my goodness, what a difference since this first broke out just before noon. That's when we saw that huge column of black smoke, a lot of fire, several explosions inside as the fire moved through. That has all died down. Another thing that is encouraging firefighters telling us just within the hour that the water they've been working with to try and fight this thing for five hours. They are getting a, a handle on that. They had a trouble. They had some trouble with water earlier, but now they've brought in tankers. They're pumping it in from a nearby pond. So that is some good news. There are actually 18 different departments working this fire. And more good news, despite one minor injury to a firefighter just in the last hour or so, all of the rest of the firefighters no injuries. The 1,000 employees who were working inside that warehouse at the time no injuries. So that is tremendous news, especially when you consider uh, what was happening inside that building. A lot of flames, many explosions, and a lot of fire. So many of you saw it. Uh, I saw it from the south side driving in uh, earlier this afternoon. I had messages from people all the way in Westfield seeing the big plume of smoke. But again, the good news is no injuries from this massive fire. We'll bring you another update in about 15 minutes.